there's something I wanted to tell you, Bella, but I think it's going to sound kind of corny. You already sound corny. Go on. It's just that I know you're unhappy a lot. A lot doesn't, doesn't quite, quite cover it. it. And uh, I just wanted to let you know that I'm never going to give you up. I'm never going to let you down. I'm never going to run around and hurt you. I'm never going to let you cry. I'm never going to say goodbye. I'm never going to run around and desert you. Also, I hate you. Oh! Bring back Edward Cullen! I like his gorgeous man abs. Oh, how I wish that Jacob Black had been born my brother, my flesh and blood brother, so that I could have some legitimate claim on him that left that still left me free of any blame now. Heaven knows I had never wanted to use him, but I couldn't help but interpret the guilt I felt now to mean that I had. Oh crap, y'all. I just said that out loud, didn't I? Ha ah! ha! Um... See ya, I guess? Yeah, sure, whatever. Go die. How could I explain to him so that he would understand? I was an empty shell, like a vacant house, CONDEMNED for months! I had just been utterly inhabitable. I mean, now I was a little improved. I mean, the front room was in better repair. But that was all. Just one small piece. And he deserved better than that. Better than a one-room falling-down piece of shirt fixer-upper. And no amount of investment on his part could ever put me back in working order. What? Oh my god, I finally found it! The meadow where Edward revealed that he was a fruitcake. Do you mind? Sorry. That piece of music deserves a better movie. Laron! Oh, hi, Bella. Howdy. Oh, hi, Bella. Are you here alone? Yep, that's the idea. Where is your email friend, the Edward Cullen? Gone. He left. Oh, that's so strange for him to leave you here so defenseless. Yep, they all left. Gone. Vemus. <laughs> Vanished. Did they visit Ethan? Why? Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? Whatever. My, My better, better God, God, what do I what pay you for? for? What? I said. She won't be happy about this. About what? About to be kidding you. <laughs> you know, if you if you knew how what Victoria had planned for you, you'd be glad that I killed you with death. Bang. Hey, hey! What are what you are doing, doing in here? here? I'm, I'm the only echoey voice, voice in this idiot's head. But, but get out before I throw you out. I'm trying to. I don't care what you're trying to do. Just get out. Fine, fine. And take your underwear with you. I don't believe it. Yeah, I know. Who would have thunk it have like an argument inside my head and stuff? Isn't that like crazy? <laughs> what the Zapdos just happened there? I'm going home. <laughs> Jacob, Jacob, Jacob. What? Jacob. What? Wait, why won't you talk to me? What did the spadoosh happen to your hair? <sighs> My grandmother came over with a weed whacker. Oh. Huh? Look, never mind. You don't, I, don't talk to me, Bella. I shouldn't be your friend anymore. But why? Why not? Because you're a whiny old lady! <laughs> well, you are so needy, well, so okay. what's your point? Uh, no, uh, anyway. Have you ever had a secret so secret that you had to tell someone, but you couldn't? Yes. I'm dangerous, Bella. You shouldn't be talking to me. I have a robot mecha Hitler in my backyard. How? Remember when I told you about the enemies of the vampires? No, okay, why would I care about the enemies for my only reason for existing? I told you about the enemies of the vampires in the last book. I wasn't listening. 
I mean, I was only focusing on the fact that you were telling me about my future boyfriend who's now gone, and that makes me sad. Just, 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 just think about it, Bella. It would hurt. I'll be back later tonight. I need to grow my hair back. What? Cut! watching the international paint drawing competition with your dad! This is quality television, isn't it, Billy Black? Why don't you ever answer me, Billy Black, man? Get out of the way, I'm a coming in! Fine, yeah, geez, God, you know warrior princess. <laughs> you, Jack, run away! Ugh. <sighs> You haven't realized yet, have you? Realized what? I'm a werewolf, a lichens are a wolf man are. Yeah. I can turn into a wolf five times my size when I'm angry. I mean Sam. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait. Five times? Yeah, so. Well, why don't you float? Why don't you all float? Everything down here floats. I mean, your density goes through the floor because your volume increases five times. I got an A in physics. I was going to say astrophysics. But no. that's beside the point. No, we actually get heavier. Don't you know anything about science? That makes no sense. It I was frozen today. Fine, you're a werewolf. Yes. This is like Inception, I mean Harry Potter. Wait, are you comparing Twilight to Harry Potter? So? The hell, why? You know, I wouldn't be surprised if this was all just a fever dream brought on by me actually getting hit by that car and I've been in a coma in a mental institution for like the last five years or something. There's a pen in my hand, but I don't know why. That, that would, would save, save us, us a, a lot, lot of trouble. trouble. I have one human friend, and he isn't even human. Oh, well, hang on, wait, what about Angela, or Jessica, or even Mike? They don't count! Well, you're welcome for killing that va French vampire fop. Oh, you mean Laurent? Oh, that was his name? Jacob, you killed a person! <sighs> Vampires don't count! Ooh, representing racism, racism without, without races. races. How, How clever. clever. But wait, if Laurent has been dead for like a week, then that means somebody's torturing and killing people now. Is it the guy from the Human Centipede? Tell me it's the guy from the Human Centipede. I know it's the guy from the Human Centipede. Don't lie to me, Jacob! Dun dun dun! dun, dun, dun. dun. You, you moron. moron. Who could it be, I wonder? Victoria. Wait, I'm confused. I need to lie down. Wait, who? Well, she's like the bitchy maid of the vampire that almost killed me in toilet and vowed revenge for Edward killing her other bitchy mate. Wait, did I just mention three people? Anyways, it's an eye for an eye sort of thing, don't you know? Wait, she was this guy's maid? Can I have your leg? <laughs> no, I'm gonna go get the other guys to track this bitch. Swan dive! Well, I'm gonna go cliff diving now. I am on a cliff overlooking the ocean. I'm a water cycle. I simply cannot believe how high up I am. I can't believe it's not butter. Stop it, Bella. Stop it. You stop it or I will kill you dead. Well, you know what? If I don't do this, then I won't see you. So, duh, I have to do it. Well, hi, I'm right here and stuff. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it, do it. Do it. No, don't listen to her. Get out! <laughs> Well, isn't it fortunate that these floaties suddenly appeared? Where are you going? Oh, well, at least I still have one. You two!
Oh well. Blub blub. Blub blub. Blub Hi. I'm a plot thread that goes nowhere. I'm not gonna give you CPR because that's what the fangirls want. What? Oh. No! What a bad! Edward? Oh, that sucks. Put me back. What? Where am I? I drove you home. You nearly drowned. No! Let me out! I have to see Edward! Yeah, maybe sooner than you think, there's a vampire car parked in the driveway. What? How do you know? Because I can smell it. Also, it's right there. Let me out! That's Car Whistle's car! You're already out. You know what? I almost drowned! Cut me some slack! No. Hello? Santa? Bella? Alice? Bella! You're supposed to be dead! You're not Santa! No, I'm not! Bella, you're supposed to be dead! I saw you jump off a cliff and start drowning, so now everybody thinks you're dead, and, and he's going to Volterra to go commit suicide by Voldemort. I mean, well, Tori. And Rosalie's still a bitch. Hi, doggy! Hi. Hello? No, he's at the funeral. Wait, who was that? Him! So I hate him. Besides, he can read my mind, so he knows it would just be some minor Native American character. Not over the phone, he can't, dumbass! Any who diddles. We need to stop Edward from walking over, you know, into the sunlight in Anne Riceland, I mean Volterra, and, you know, showing himself that he's a vampire. Wouldn't they just think he's crazy and he smeared glitter all over himself? I should call him back. What's the appropriate waiting time to call a guy back? No! That is beside the point. I need to pack. Done and done. Ding! I love you. No, don't go. Jacob, are you that dense? Edward is the most important thing in my life. Well, at the very least, give me another book to shove it. Okay, it's a deal. Alice, is there a cat in there? Well, airplane penis just don't do it for me anymore. You're more hopeless than Charlie. Can I have it? I'm out of peanuts. Calm down! Calm down! Calm down! You want me to calm down? Look, why don't you just tell me why you're still alive? Okay? I saw you jumping off a cliff and drowning. I was saved by Jacob. That explains it. Explains what? I can't see a werewolf. For some inadequately explored reason. Just want to tell you both good luck. We're all counting on you. Hi, do you know where Edward Cullen's about to expose himself? Okay, thanks, bye! Yeah. 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 Finally, he's back! Bring back Jacob Black! Oh, that's a fool. Double rainbow, oh my god, double rainbow. Like what the hell do I undress? I'm threatened yeah, by her beauty! I'm getting axe murdered! Damn, oh my god. What does this mean? I'm so bright, so This is only song! Why can't you be Edward? Hey! Edward! Cut it out! Cut it out, Edward! Edward! Cut it out! I must be dead because I can hear the dead. Hi, I'm real. I'm not dead. Rosalie's still a biatch. Let's go home. Yeah, about that. You guys are gonna have to come with us. Also, for the love of Anne Rice, would you put this on? I didn't think I was dressed that indecently. Why is he talking? Why is he talking like that? Well, we are in Italia. Isn't it Italy? Aero sent me to see what was taking so long. Now I'm bored, so I'm leaving. And you better follow me, or else I'll kill you with my care bear step. <laughs> Hi, I'm here now. How did you get here? 
I walked. I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Jane. Look, Master, see what I brought for you. Oh, hi, Edward. Oh, hi, Alice. Oh, hi, Bella. And I'm stuck. Oh, hi, Mr. Banner. It's so nice to finally meet you. I've heard so much about you. Come on, Flatter. How the hell did you get here? Oh, I shipped myself by FedEx. Also, uh, jet powered by unicorns. Probably common nowadays, weirdly. Felix, be a dear and tell my brothers about our company. I'm sure they wouldn't want to miss this. Um, right away. I love a happy ending. They are so rare. Marcus and Caius, look, it's, it's Bella and she's alive after all. Isn't that lovely? Isn't that wonderful? And look, Alice is here too. Isn't that lovely? Isn't that wonderful? How's your sex life? <laughs> Let us have the story. Oh, my name's Jerry. God, your hand is really veiny. It looks like a witch's hand. <laughs> what the story, Marcus? Marcus can see relationships. He's surprised by the intensity of ours. Also, Aero can read every thought you've ever had just by touching him. Wait, that makes no sense. I beg your pardon? I mean... Um, memory isn't like a computer or a library or something. Things fall out, right? I mean, not every thought is cataloged, right? Yeah, sure. Yeah, 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 right? Okay. I like pudding. Haven't you ever heard of a sovereign heart? It's, it's hair in my mouth. Ugh. But not everybody's a savin, I think. Savin? Seven, seven, we'll go seven. What the hell's going on here? <laughs> but who is to say that the memory of a seven is any different than any of ours? I mean, maybe we can't ac access stuff that they can, you know? Yeah. This is just getting way too philosophical for me. Really? Because it seems to me that you're the expert on memory. After all, your mantra is, it's a poor sort of memory that only works backward. You see what I did there? I referenced an Alice book. You like that? But, oh, forgive me, I wanted to test something. Apparently, Bella is immune to powers of the mind, at least when Edward's in, in question. So I wanted to try something, may I? Ask her. I did. Oh. What? You're indeed at the front desk. Oh. Yay. Ugh. I'm not getting anything. That's because she's, she's never had any thoughts. thoughts. Quiet! Yes, that's exactly what I'm hearing. Interesting. Jane, dear. No! Ah! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> now do that to Bella. 
<laughs> Take out the trash! She's immune to my powers of the mind. Can we go home now? You haven't taken out the trash! But first I must ask, join me, Edward, and together we can rule... Forks. No. <laughs> Well, you have a sister. If you won't join me, perhaps she will pass. Okay, what about Bella? Join you for what? Dinner? Russia! No City is a super vampire Volturi Fantastic Fudge Coded Edition. Mega Man! No! <laughs> Pointless lightsaber battle! <laughs> 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 to spell your name! I was eating Hitler! Uh, I became a vampire in 1918. You shut up! You did this to me! You're like 5,000 years old. I did nothing to you. I was frozen today, Lisa! Russia! You're still here? Yes? I'm fed up with this world! Oh, shoot. Oh! Oh! Yeah. All my screen time! <laughs> is Arrow a bit mental? Well, he is like 5,000 years old. Immortality does that, you know? Makes it crazy. Stop looking at me like that! No. Well, bye, fellas. It was nice to see you. We have some takeout coming in, so bye. Send my regards to Carlisle, huh? Oh, hi, Volturis. It's so nice to have you for dinner. I'm holding an invisible fork and knife. Wait, won't the authorities realize that like 40 people went missing today? And how did they all fit in that elevator? Are you talking? All I hear is buzzing. I miss you so much.
So, who thinks I should become a vampire and join the family? Edward? No, you're staying human. Jerk. Alice? Of course. Jasper? He says yes. Rosalie? No, because I wish someone would vote no for me. Gah! Emmett? Hell yeah! Mr. Banner? Russia! I'm taking that as a yes. Esme? Yes, I already consider you part of the family. Carlisle? Edward, it's the only thing that makes sense in this goddamn mixed up world. Kiss me. No! Something tells me that Edward doesn't want to change me. Carlisle, after graduation? Huh? 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 Yeah. Yes, I will kill you after graduation. Awesome. Now wait a second, isn't there another book and a half before you actually become a vampire? Shut up! Oh, I forgot someone's vote. Bella narrator? <sighs> what? I was dreaming about zombies. Should I become a vampire? Well, you're gonna kill yourself by accident someday anyway, so you might as well. Sweet! It's unanimous! No, it's not! Rosalie and I voted no! But your votes don't count! Will you marry me? What?! Will. You. Isabella's why you stay away from the Edward Cullen. He's no good for you! He's, well, he's too high fat! Yeah, pick me instead! I'm a werewolf! I still wanna kill you! Who are you people? Shut up, all of you, okay? Just let me think about it. Correction, let me waffle for 600 pages and stretch out these plots that should only take at most 100 pages so we can milk some more money out of this franchise. Shut up! Never!
is wrong with you? Why did you hit me? The last time I hit you was three days ago.